In the womb of time, they were wolves. Canine warriors silently tracking Chuchi tribesmen as they both hunted the same reindeer in the Siberian Arctic of Siberian wilderness. 110 years ago, this highway of the north led dogs and mushers to the 1898 gold fields in the Klondike. 110 years ago, men froze, dogs died. Today, they team with man and run as Yukon Quest International Sled Dogs. For the Yukon Quest of 2008, 10 dogs were flown from Soamsville, Maine to Fairbanks, Alaska. These dogs are part of a nonprofit program working with at risk youth called Pulling Together. What do you think about these cold temperatures we have? It's cold. We have to put some time, we have to put some jackets. That's why we put jacket on the dogs to protect them from the, the cold. Mushers carry mandatory equipment, food, and supplies at all times. After 500 miles into the Yukon Quest, Dawson City, Yukon, the midpoint is a mandatory 36-hour rest stop. Well, the first couple of days was brutal. We started out, I think it was 50 below. And uh, my first camp out on Birch Creek, my thermometer on my sled was maxed out at 60. You know, I don't know how cold it was, but as cold as I've ever been. How do dogs handle that kind of cold? Oh, they're tougher than I am. <laughs> no, they, have, they really don't have a problem with it. You know, it's uncomfortable for them, so you make sure you have dog coats. There are eight checkpoints along the 1,000-mile trail some of which consist of six to eight hour mandatory rests. Communities along the trail still show their support by providing meals and opening centers and cabins at each checkpoint along the way. Teams run and rest around the clock. Dog internal clocks determine work hours, not the wristwatch. At rest stops, dogs' booties are removed, mushers cook the next meal, dogs are fed, but feet are as important as stomachs, and mushers check and recheck their dog's feet, not overlooking coat, harnesses, and attitude. And if lucky, all sleep. As a lower 48er, it was difficult for us to keep up with the mushers, even with four-wheel drive and extra fuel tanks. The Yukon Quest is a true test of human and canine endurance and interdependence. Survival depends on a mutual, sometimes wordless bond between human and dog. <laughs> 